a, um, a service right, that is using a DAO to retrieve data from a, some mongoose uh, implementation. So let's use this and expose it. Uh, so this is the service part of a web service, right? And let's uh, let's uh, uh, implement it through the controllers, right? Where we were retrieving all the quizzes instead of using the old implementation, right? Of the service. Oh, I guess we had here. Oh, we already had quiz service. Oh, did I implement it in the wrong place? Oh, yeah, we already had quiz service. <laughs> okay, so I'm not going to. Uh, re-implement it. Okay, so re-implemented it here. There it is, right? Yeah, well, it's using the old implementation, right? It's using this array, right? So we are replacing this, right? So I'm just going to abandon this uh, service. Uh, so let's uh, let's go to the controller, the quiz controller, and I'm not going to use this old service. I'm going to use a new service. This will be cons Call the same way, quiz service. But we are going to use the other implementation called quizzes service. Okay. Um, we're not going to be able to create new new quizzes, right? That makes no sense because we are a, we are a students. So we can create or delete quizzes. So I'm going to abandon that. Instead, we can create a new quiz, right? We can create a new quiz. I'm sorry, we can retrieve all the quizzes or retrieve a specific quiz. Uh, so to retrieve all the quizzes, uh, notice that we had already looked at implementing that, right? The way this works is that you use service, find all the quizzes, and that's going to return a promise. And then that promise, right, is going to have embedded the uh, result, which is going to be all the quizzes. And then we can just send that back to the um, to the client, right? So if we restart the server and we head over to the client and refresh, notice that indeed now we have the six quizzes, right, that uh, we had stored in the database. See that? All right. So we were we effectively were able to uh, connect a you know Angular application, right? That that used to be displaying our hard coded array of quizzes. Now it's going to work. it's going all the way down to Mongo, retrieving the data from a collection, right, and then displaying it in the user interface.